in front, the Minjiang River, Qingyi River, and Dadu River meet. Behind the undulating Lingyun Mountain stands, Leshan Giant Buddha was carved in Jiazhou in the first year of the Kaiyuan era of the Tang Dynasty, 1,311 years ago. The carving of the Leshan Giant Buddha is said to be based on people's simple belief that the Buddha could suppress the raging flood every summer. After completion, the Buddha sits as tall as 71 meters, with 1,051 hair buns overhead. 90 years of carving makes it the world's largest existing city in Matrinia. With belief and wisdom, the craftsman has shaped the giant Buddha's tranquil and deep appearance, as well as its majestic and calm sitting posture. As a giant Buddha embodying people's belief and hope, it has been perfectly protected since the completion of this creation. There was a Dashan pavilion built around the giant Buddha, a building of 13 floors with a height from the Buddha's head to the foot, which was used to provide shelter from wind and rain for this giant Buddha. However, the pavilion was ultimately destroyed by war, thus making the giant Buddha directly exposed to the sun and rain. Fortunately, craftsmen planned ahead and carved the giant Buddha deep into the cliffs alleviating and reducing the degree of weathering of the stone carving. Additionally, they constructed a connected drainage channel through the giant Buddha's top spiral hair buns, ears, shoulders, and chest, as well as setting three stories of drainage channels behind the Buddha's head and shoulders to intercept sea page water. There are two fine drainage channels among these spiral hair buns of the giant Buddha extending along the front top of the giant Buddha's hair buns to the back of his ears, which guides the accumulated water from the groove of giant Buddha's hair buns together in the lowest spiral hair buns drainage channel. To prevent the giant Buddha's accumulated water from the head flowing to its face, the water flows into the channel behind the ears and then is prominently discharged from the ditches on both sides. The patterns on the giant Buddha's body also serve a familiar function stopping the flow of water along the body and slowing down the erosion and destruction of the rock by water. Undoubtedly, as time passes, all the protections are not full enough. After undergoing a millennial evolution, the giant Buddha also experiences various damages, such as the Buddha body's water seepage and weathering and vegetation growth. However, with the development of technology, the difficulty of beautifying the giant Buddha has been greatly reduced. Studying the mountain materials, clearing the surface of the vegetation, and conducing partial restoration and beautification of the Leshan giant Buddha make his solemn again. A thousand years of development, a thousand years of changes. Over the millennia, people have protected this giant Buddha through different forms and techniques allowing us to naturally appreciate the creation of the Tang Dynasty. The Grand Giant Buddha not only reflects the faith, hope, history, and culture, but also embodies the diligent, wise, and brave spiritual character of generations of the Bashu people.